Hello football streamers, it's your boy Boanjalo here, about to bring you the latest transfer news and updates regarding the ins and outs of the Premier League. We all know that this is a transfer deadline and anything goes, so let's jump right on to it. First up, we heard breaking news that uh, Demari Gray from Leicester City the dribbling wizard has joined Bundesliga side by Oliver Kuzin on a permanent deal. Demari Gray has continuing the recent trend of uh, English youngsters going over to Germany to enhance their footballing skills. So let's hope this is a good move for him, a fresh start, and uh, hopefully he will get more game time. Uh, moving on, we all know Liverpool struggles at the back recently with the injury crisis of losing Virgil van Dijk, who has been hard to replace, and having to play Jordan Henderson and Fabinho at the back. But we understand that Liverpool are close to agreeing a deal for Ben Davis, the Preston North End centre-back, in a move worth about £2 million. So we all understand that this deal is likely to be concluded before the transfer deadline day. Staying with Liverpool, they have been linked with Schalke 04 defender, the highly rated Ozan Kubak, who is said to be having a medical for Liverpool in Germany as we speak. Initially, Schalke would loan him with an obligation of 30 million euros obligation to buy him from Schalke so let's stay tuned for that interesting news really and uh, moving on Tottenham Hotspur we all know Dele Ali since Jose Mourinho has come in it's been hard for him to get game time however there looks to be lights at the end of the tunnel for him as he's linked with a move to PSG where he will link up with former manager Mauricio Pochettino. However, this move is hinging on the fact that Tottenham need to get a replacement before allowing Dele Ali to move. And we all know that uh, Jose Mourinho is a man who likes to get players in, especially players that he wants. So we understand that Tottenham have been linked to the move for former playmaker Christian Eriksen, who left last year, this time, for Inter Milan in Germany. And they have also been linked to the move for Borussia Mönchengladbach midfielder um, Flora Nihes. So stay tuned and still with Tottenham as well. We understand that they are linked to the move for Angel Di Maria, who worked with Jose Mourinho at Real Madrid when Mourinho was in charge of the Spanish Giants. So watch the space. And Newcastle's DeAndre Yedling was in Istanbul having a medical ahead of a move to Galatasaray. And moving on to transfer rumors within the Premier League. We understand that Dayot Upamecano, the highly rated 23-year-old French defender, has been linked to the move to both Manchester United and Chelsea, who are having some issues at the back. However, with his £38 million buyout loss, anything is possible. However, the Premier League giants are facing stiff competition from Bundesliga giants Bayern Munich, who have a knack of just signing the best talent from rival Germany clubs. And yeah, let's watch the space and see where this goes. Uh, staying on with in the Premier League, we understand that Burnley defender James Tarkovsky has been linked to the move to both West Ham United and Leicester City, with both teams having made pre-season bids of around 30 million pounds so so this is a good defender for those teams that are interested in him let's see where this materializes or not and uh, going on liverpool again we understand that they have been also linked with arsenal defender shokran mustafi 
the German World Cup winner. So stay tuned and watch the space. We don't know how that's going to unfold. And uh, again, both Manchester United and Chelsea have been linked with Borussia Dortmund hitsman Ilan Haaland who has been scoring goals since he passed onto the scene and this is likely to start a bidding war between the two and Borussia Dortmund they don't let go of their players that easy so really both teams have to fork out the cash and finally we understand that Sergio Ramos has also been linked to the move to the Premier League uh, in the summer with his contract at Real Madrid running out and he is yet to agree new terms with the Spanish deal. There are a number of Premier League teams that would love to have him in their team. So stay tuned and keep watching Football Extreme. Subscribe to Football Extreme, like our page and stay tuned for more. I'm out.